Alright, morning. It's June the 21st. So it's the solstice. And I really want to get everything planted. After this cut. And the uh, second part of compost right to it. We're going to plant the tomatoes. As you can see, we've changed the plastic cover. Uh, the old one was going to be a bit smaller, a bit tatty. So we've made a bit of a more simple, more of a wind protection. So let's uncover it. Now these are the tomatoes we're planting here. These are tomato orange banana. Now we've also got gardeners delight, but they're not going in here. Put them out of the way. And these are our peppers, which we can do later. Same as these. The cause yet to go in quite strong. It's the first male flower. And uh, the compost is sinking down. We'll just take these out. And we'll take off the covers. As you can see, we're still putting the green waste in. And we're going to put the tomatoes at the back here. And we're going to also barrier that off. Now they're still a little small these tomatoes, it's not ideal weather up here in Horn. And also because these are outdoors, they're only going to the third truss, because they won't set fruit in the autumn otherwise. And we're also going to plant them so that we can fill some soil up around them afterwards. So we're just going to dig a little hole. Very full of worms now. Just sort of want to see. Now we are planting these close because we want to get the maximum out of these plants. So a lot of people say too much in here, too many courgettes, too many tomatoes, but you can, uh, you've got very little space that we need to plant nice and dense. Now hopefully these will come up, as they come up, you can put a bit more soil, and put more roots out, and we'll get better tomato plants. As I say, we're still composting. So, coffee grinds and the veg peelings. Now, the thing that's important when you're doing something like this is to make sure this stuff is well chopped. Don't throw whole carrots, whole cabbages in. That's pretty slimy and horrible. Now, I think the old shaving beddings from the dead rabbit, which was here a couple of years ago apparently. We can add this to. This will help to keep it from getting too slimy and smelly and full of flies. One thing I should say is, the 
this linoleum, brilliant material. Well, it's full of surprises, and that's one of them. compost ratatouille and if we just put this back protect them all from the wind and that's it so hopefully we have everything planted by the end of today so everything done the 21st of June that's just got to grow